everyone. This is Kimmy Wyatt. Hello. Welcome to this video on uh, the enhanced infused and enhanced uh, undiluted vitamin and mineral enriched rice water uh, that you guys can buy. Uh, I'm going to be doing some hair myths in this video. M-Y-T-H-S and I do apologize for talking out of my nose. It seems like I'm okay until I get ready to record and my, my nose will say, oh no. <laughs> so uh, my sinuses are, and allergies are not, are, are not being nice today. So sorry about that, you guys. And also subscribe to the YouTube channel and be sure to click that notification bell so that you will be one of the first to get notifications of new vids I post up. And also, uh, once you do that, check out the playlist, the natural hair playlist, and you'll, you will see, I think there's about 20 videos on there already uh, about natural hair. And there are already some myths about protein. I just did a video on my twist pudding, which is absolutely wonderful for your hair. It's growing people's hair. And uh, uh, check out that video. And it's the official, very well, the very first video on the twist pudding and I just posted that up as well. And it's called, uh, uh, my, I don't know. You have to check it out because I, I was going back and forth, forth with the title. So I just washed my hair and I'm ready to, this is my personal stash of rice water. Okay. And, uh, for ordering the rice water, you can see where the text is posted and, and it will be there eventually if it's not already there. Because I am going over every video to make sure I said what I meant to say and I'm changing the descriptions, etc., etc. All right. So uh, I just did this video, and what I was trying to do, or what it was very nice, was show you the rice water in here uh, where it has settled down and how it looks just like little, like cloudy water. Uh, even, even more cloudy or even less cloudier than this right here. Okay. Uh just just looks like water. Just regular water that's like a little dingy. Well, I had to redo the video because my nose was running and, <laughs> and my nose was like running, you know, and so I had this so oh I it it I accidentally stopped the video, which is okay. So this has already been stirred up and but you would have seen it in the other video where it was just you know little cloudy okay so first thing I'm going to do is go over a couple of myths about rice water uh, questions do I can I use brown rice yes you can but it's not necessary because brown rice is a little more expensive than regular bagged white rice okay that's all you need to use uh, you don't have to cook it that's an option uh, I have never cooked my rice water uh, I've always let it sit up and ferment on its own accord uh, and they, there's also been myths about how long to let your rice water ferment. Yes, within 24 hours, your rice water has begun fermenting, but you can keep it longer. As a matter of fact, the rice water that I offer to uh, my customers is actually 20 plus or 30 day, 30 plus day uh, infused enhanced rice water. What you're going to get is a lot of protein. And I'm going to show you the rice water in here. You're going to be like, oh my God, <laughs> this, mine, mine has never looked like that. There's a reason for that. And also uh, every grain of, of the rice water that I offer to, offer to the customers has not every single grain, but it goes through a, uh, a process so that you're going to get more minerals and more vitamins than just some rice water just sitting up you know, for 12 to 24 hours. Okay. Uh, so what, what you're going to get in the end, re the end result of that is more minerals, more vitamins and more protein. So this rice water has to be diluted. Okay. It has to be diluted. You don't want crunchy ends. You don't want your hair crunchy because of all the protein. So you're going to have to dilute it. Uh, so I send it to you undiluted, however, and you can put as much water, uh, that you want. I suggest 50-50, a 50-50 ratio or one-to-one -one ratio, meaning uh, what, however much however much rice water you use, use that same amount of water to dilute it. So if you use a cup of rice water, use a cup of uh, water, okay? You use half a cup of rice water, use half a cup of regular water. 
the water, uh, the regular water. Does it have to be cold? No, just regular tap water. Okay. You can even, uh, uh, here's another myth. And I was going to say something else. You could, I was going to say you could even heat it up if you would like, you know, to your likeness, like in the microwave or whatever. And the reason for that is because of this myth. There's a myth that, or is, I don't want to say so much it's a myth, but people don't realize rice water is still food. And so it comes from rice. And so what do you do with excess food? You put it in the what? Refrigerator. You can actually refrigerate your rice water, you guys. You don't have to use the rice water immediately. Like some people say, you don't have to do that. That is, that's, that's not true. I have been producing rice water for a minute now. And uh, trust me, I have never not refrigerated my right excess rice water. Okay. There's a myth for you. And so with, with mine as well as your own DIY or whatever you can refrigerate it if you make more than enough okay and how long it can stand a refrigerator how long trust me uh I would make this huge big gigantic batch like of those big <laughs> 30 like gallon things or whatever unless, unless you're going to be you know you may have something going on I don't know about but no if you're just going to be making you know enough for like maybe three washings you know, and all that, you know, after you've washed your hair, yeah, go ahead, you know, and, and do it. And, you know, and because rice uh, is 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 it's a, an abundance here on the planet, you don't have to worry about probably running, ever running out of rice water. Who knows? Okay. So what I'm going to show you, uh, this is settled down, thank goodness, because I had to restart the video. This is, this, like I said, these are my personal stashes of rice water. And you can see down at the bottom where it has settled, okay? You can see down there at the bottom where the rice water has settled. And if I shake it, you'll see it going down to the bottom, all right? I don't want to shake it too much because I want to show you how it looks. There's a piece of hair off in there, sorry. But I want to show you how the rice water looks just sitting up. And trust me, it's, it's a little clearer than this. I've already sh shaken this. But you see how it's going to this, it's going down, okay. But if I shake it, there you go. Now, this, I, I, I hate that I had to start this video over because you would have seen the rice water where it was just almost clear water, almost clear, okay. Ta-da! But that's nothing. That's almost like this. And trust me, this has been, uh, let me tell you, this has been diluted. And it's that, and it's that white. And it's been diluted. So like I said, please, please dilute the rice water I'm going to be sending to you guys. Because it is very enriched and infused and, uh, and, and mineral enriched, vitamin enriched and a lot of protein. Okay. So yeah, that's what that's basically what that means. All right. Uh so here we have This was like like I said I had to start the video over, but this was like clear, like literally clear on the top. But I want to show you something. This is a this is a fork. All right. Hold on, let me grab it. Just look, check out the rice water. Check out how it is turning. Let me get it out of the into the light. Yeah. Wow. I bet your wise water doesn't look like that. Like I said, I take it through a process where every grain is being used to uh, get you guys very enriched rice water. And the enhanced is the smell. It has. It does not have that stinky smell that rice water is famous for having it smells pretty good as a matter of fact okay there we go so there's still rice in here by the way look at that look at the fork lots of protein lots of protein lots of vitamins and minerals Okay, 
Wow. <laughs> That's amazing. So this is what you'll get. Uh, undiluted, infused, and enhanced rice water with more minerals, more vitamins, and definitely more protein uh, than just you know what what you would normally hear about uh, or see in a video or maybe your old rice water that you've produced okay so you don't have to worry about producing rice water because I can send it to you and I will send it to you but like I said it's, I stress that you have to dilute it okay it has to be look at that it has to be diluted and it's so rich that this is diluted 50% that little hair in there is just like Oh, well, that wasn't a hair. There's something on there. Yeah, 50%. And see, check this out. There's not much of a difference. So that lets you know that it is very, very rich. And this has been, whatever was in here originally, 50% water was put in there. Okay, in here. And it still looks like this. So go figure. Imagine how rich this is. This one. Okay. My little finger was, yeah, from this little thing. Yeah, imagine, imagine, imagine how rich that is, okay? Information for ordering, ordering, excuse me, the rice water is where the text is posted for the video. And, uh, yeah, you guys, and how often should you use rice water? I, rice water has, has never hurt anyone except for too much protein. If you make your rice water like I produce and you don't rinse it out, it has the possibility of making, making your hair a little crunchy. But you could, uh, you could do a leave-in if you dilute it even more so than 50%, uh, such as like a leave-in conditioner. But make sure it's well diluted, okay? Please, because it's critical that you don't want your hair crunchy and all of that. But how often... I, I use rice water every wash, okay? I use it every wash, after every wash, and uh, then I put my product, my, my twist pudding, on my hair, and I may or may not twist my hair right then, but I'll put a plastic bag. If I, if I already know I'm too busy to twist it that day, then I'll just uh, go ahead and apply the product on my hair, the twist pudding, put a bag on my head, a shower cap, you know, whatever, to retain the moisture, because my hair, I am a true 4C, and I cannot afford to have my hair dry out at all. Even though the product is on there, and not going to dry out. I just, I have to retain moisture, and uh, with the product does. So, please uh, check out the videos, all of the videos. If you have questions, uh, uh, please post your comments below, and I will answer those questions as I see them. Uh, about rice water and the, and the myths about rice water and uh, like I said yes you can you can refrigerate it you don't have to use it immediately you don't have to use it within 24 hours these are all best rice is, it's rice it's rice it's rice water put it in the refrigerator just like you would leftover rice I mean come on uh, some of these uh, videos you guys be careful of, of whom you're paying attention to and listening to uh, and like I said, if it's going to be this protein rich, please dilute it on a, a, with a one to one ratio or you could dilute it. It's so protein enriched and enhanced and everything that you can actually put even more water if that's your choice. So dilute it to your liking and uh, you could try it if you want to. <laughs> I don't suggest it without diluting it, but I'm going to tell you, you're, 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 it's going to, you're going to get crunchy hair. Okay. Unless you're mixing it with something, uh, maybe uh, uh, something that you already have that you're going to put on your hair, I, I just wouldn't do it, okay? Because you can't have you can't have protein overload, and that's not something that you want. All right, this is Kimmy Wyatt. Check out the text if it's not there right now, and I and trust me, it won't be once was uh, when I post this up. Come back, and you will see the the information for ordering this product. All right. Enhanced and infused, uh, uh, undiluted uh, vitamin, vitamin and mineral enriched rice water. And like I said, uh, infused simply means you're not, you're going to love the smell. I, I hope you love the smell. It smells really great. Uh, when I, and for those of you who don't know much about rice water, when I talk about the smell, <laughs> I, I, 
I can tell you what I think it smells like, but it would be graphic. Okay, so I'm just going <laughs> to... Rice water is not the best smelling thing on the planet because it's been sitting up fermenting. No refrigeration prior. You just have it sitting up if that's how you've done it. Some people will cook the rice and go from there, but uh, get the excess water off. Absolutely unnecessary. You're wasting, you're ab actually, you're wasting energy. You're making your electric bill go up because it's not necessary. Just prepare in advance. If you're going to be using rice water, prepare in advance and, and, and prepare it the natural way. Okay. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> so... I forgot what I was saying prior to that, but but yeah, you guys check it out, check it out, and you this come it comes in a variety of sizes, undiluted. Keep in mind, undiluted, and it's going to ferment even more. That's why it's twenty day or thirty thirty twenty plus or thirty plus day rice water because it's actually going to ferment in the shipping process. It's going to ferment even more, which is okay. It does, rice water does not have to be in the refrigerator, but uh, once you get it in, in, in your hands, you want to keep it for a little longer. You know you're not going to use all of it, blah, 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 blah. Go ahead and refrigerate it, okay? And it's okay. And I don't, I think I went over how long. Oh, I think I started telling you how long to keep rice water in the refrigerator. Uh, if, uh, first of all, once you get, I can only speak for my rice water. Uh, because it is protein and vitamin and mineral uh, enriched, uh, please refrigerate the rice water you get from, from me. I highly suggest it because it's going to last longer and it's not just going to be sitting up there fermenting and fermenting and fermenting and fermenting, okay? Even more. Totally unnecessary. Uh, so refrigerate it and you could, you could dilute the entire container. Uh, if you get a 16 ounce, do, it'll make 32. If you do a one-to-one -one ratio, for instance, or you could just dilute as you go. Okay, that's up to you. But, uh, yes, check it out. Uh, but please refrigerate because, you you know, it, it's already fermented and you don't want uh, disaster to come. I've never, <laughs> I've never had rice water uh, uh, processed more than 30 days. So I couldn't tell you how that would go. And I really don't want to know how that would go. So, there you go. <laughs> this is Kimmy Wyatt. Hasta la vista. Buenas horas. Buenas noches. Arriba del che. Avrevoa salida. Don't let the doorknob hit you where the good Lord split you. Chao bela. Chao belo. Smooches. Gotta go. Bye. But before I go, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stir this up again to show you guys. Wow. That is amazing. That is absolutely amazing. It looks like a big thing of Elmer's glue. <laughs> because it's it's I, I don't know about what you guys what you guys see, but to me it's even wider than vitamin than milk. It's even wider than milk. Yeah. Okay. Um and also by the way, I will be coming out with soaps, natural soaps. All of my products are at least 90% natural. And I'm going to be honest with you. I don't think I have a product that's not 100% natural. But I have to, uh, at this point, just say 90%. So I'm going to be coming out with soaps that are going to be 100% natural. I'm also going to be coming out with uh, products that are going to contain. I am so excited about this. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm going to be coming out. Look at that. Wow. I'm going to be coming out with products that contain rice water. Okay. Enhanced and infused rice water uh, for your skin. Okay, it's my baby. All right, bye.